What's going on you guys? Today I'm, I'm playing a new game. Well, technically it's an old game, but a game I never played before. And it's this, Until Dawn. Um, it's a horror game. And I'm gonna be playing a gameplay reaction video on this. So, whoever's watching, I hope you enjoy and I'll just get into it. So first of all, I'm just gonna check out this oh, okay so I just collect random stuff in the game probably bonus content oh there's bonus content oh, okay this is probably like after you finish the game okay I might just go into settings just in case maybe I'm gonna put on subtitles brightness I've already done that Text. Okay, it should be good. Yeah. All right. Let's do it. Oh shit! A tiny butterfly flapping its wings. Look. Okay. okay. I've seen people play this game. I've heard it's a very scary game. Very scary game. Shape how the story unfolds. Okay. Carefully. In a in a horror game, that's pretty hard thing to do. Choosing your actions, you know. Okay. weekend. Josh. Oh, so I'm using be moving about now. Okay. Let's see. Is there anything I can check out? Sticks to look around objects and 
Okay. What is this? Take it. You look so damn hot. So okay. Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Damn. That's awkward. Okay. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us oh. all. I got your note. Glad you could make it. Oh, this is so cringe. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. Matt? Damn. What are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, it's all gonna be just a stupid. Uh, you guys are jerks. That's, you know that? That's fucked up. Anna. That's so fucked up. Oh man. Okay, so the tutorial is the right stick. Uh, wake Josh, find overs. Uh, maybe wake Josh? Josh! Josh! Fuck! Guys! There's someone outside! What the hell? Oh no. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? <sighs> it's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? Damn. You're just messing around, Dad. That wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! After her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Oh, what a shit. dickhead. What an absolute dickhead. Oh no, okay, so fast, save. Let's go save. Oh man. This is so not good. Um, full of noise, full of footsteps, footprints, yeah, footprints. Oh no. Damn. Dear. Hello? Hello? Oh, what is this? Okay, so we found the uh, item. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah. These two are gonna die. Sweet as 
I didn't want to grab onto that guy because it's a bad guy, but or th I don't know, maybe he was trying to help, but who knows. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right, we will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up the card? Okay. And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. it. It is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. Okay. Oh boy. Um. So, how... Did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Be honest. Uh, I mean, it there's it doesn't look like there's nothing wrong with it, so I feel happy, probably. Well, that's good. In what way did it make you happy? Okay. <laughs> the sunshine. So which word would best describe how you feel about darkness? Darkness? Uh, damn. Afraid? Really? That 
That's interesting. Where I come from, way up north in Sweden, the nights are 18 hours long. <laughs> and why do you think you're afraid of the dark? Uh, everyone fears it. Oh no, 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 not everyone. But it's a perfectly natural fear. Darkness, after all, is the unseen and therefore the unknown. And what could inspire fear more than the terror of uncertainty? Oh dear, we seem to be out of time for this session. We'll talk again soon. Until then, I suggest you try to stay away from dark places. Oh wow. Okay. That guy's a weirdo. Here we go. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. This is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, with their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this, and that uh, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you, and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget. For for the sake of my sisters, and, you know. Okay, so, let's, 
party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip <laughs> we'll that? never forget, all right? Yes! Let's do it. Oh, he's there. What? And his best friend, adventurous. Okay. Climb over. Climb over, okay. Maybe I can go here. Oh, damn. Safe. Just do it safe. Uh, climb. This is spooky. Oh, hey, little fella. You hungry? Huh? Oh, oh what? Oh, okay. Hey, hey, hey. Dang it. It's okay. That's it. Come on. Don't move. Don't move. That's cool. What is this? Deaf black butterflies proposed by the deaths. Danger red butterflies warned. Brown butterflies warded of tragedy and affecting friends. Guidance yellow butterflies offered visions to help and guide. White butterflies brought dreams.
Okay. Possible future. I see a bird. I saw a bird. Okay. Is uncertain whether not prophecy comes. Okay. Oh, okay. So I can view this, right? Oh, shit. Okay. I can view this. And I have another one. Oh, that's, that's when they died. Oh, crap. So. Okay, so this is guidance. Oh, okay. This is death. Interesting. Okay. Oh my god, what the heck? The view is actually pretty decent. Damn. The past is beyond our control. I'm just gonna look around. Maybe there's something here I can check out, like this. Bags here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Hello. What do we have here? Uh. Snoop. Nah, just close bag. Hey, you made it. Protective, humorous. Okay, has a crush on Ashley. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. Blow my mind. Okay. God, this game is actually scary as heck. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right, here goes. All right. Uh. Okay. How do I shoot? Wait, what? Part two. I was pressing that. Okay, shoot that again. I'm pressing R2. There we go. Oh, it's probably because I tried to aim in, but it didn't work. There we go. Wow, nice shooting ticks. Alright, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Oh no. I'm not shooting, I'm not shooting that. Fuck that. Squirrel must nice live. Shot. Your ass just got sacked. Hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Butterfly effect. Status update. OK. 
Okay. Um. Okay. Let's carry on. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear the moment I got here, it just oh. all came flooding back. Here goes fast. Oh, man. Clue found. Wanted poster. Nice. You think we'll get a visit from America's most wanted? Looks like someone thought so. Oh come on, this place is abandoned most of the year. Can we come up here? Okay. You can't see his face. Gonna close to solve the mysteries of until dawn. It must be really hard on Josh. I I don't know how he keeps it all. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Alright. That's for you. Oh, real gentleman. Let's have a look. Blackwood Pine. Guess we gotta wait. Hotel. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. Family bought a mountain. Bath. Damn, dude. Someone's watching you. Whoa, what was the noise? Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but... Let's do it. Let's do it. Just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good. Good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? Damn. So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra? I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. He said it. The butterfly effect. Okay, so this is a new character. Jess.
Mike's new girlfriend, Justin, Justin, irrelevant. Irre okay. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Uh, okay. What oh the shit. Hell? Jed, Damn. Hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Yeah, click it. Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris! My goodness! Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Um... I guess I should be honest. Maybe I'll go on. Yeah, I'll be Mike honest. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. Alright, alright. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, okay. You guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know, whoever. Uh -huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Okay, Emily, Mike's ex. Resourceful, pers persuasive. Okay. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend, ambitious, active. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Washington Lodge grounds. <sighs> Damn. Yeah, We're almost there. No, I'm getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Ah! Oh, shit! Jesus! <laughs> Mike, Emily's ex. <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're Damn. all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Um Michael I'm just going to lay it out otherwise this whole weekend's going to suck ass for everyone. Um This is super awkward and we all know it. Let's just uh acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt, I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check <laughs> the cable car back on the trip. Right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya. Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah. All the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed oh to talk God. to her before we get all the way up there. I just really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Fake relationships. 
Um, yeah, just okay. I'll go. Just say that. All right. Fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me. Well, then we're even at least. Wait, what? I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there. I didn't want to say that. Thank you. Damn. Okay. Fake relationships, am I right? Let's see here. Someone's watching. Oh. That's a new character. Ashley has a crush on Chris. Inquisitive. Four right. Four right. Let's see what do I need to find? Whoa, hello. Uh, Somebody's getting a little friendly. Wow, but dude. Not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Wow. Are they gonna kiss? Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Fuck you know. <laughs> Sorry about that ash, I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real scare you. Oh my you. gosh, oh my gosh! Hey, well, man, I'm not really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it, Let me check it out. Uh, oh, shit, okay. Mislead is busted. Take a look. Should I, though? Maybe. Uh. I mean, yeah, he needs to know the truth. I mean, come um, on, he needs sure, to know uh, the truth. Go, go ahead, knock yourself out. He needs yes. to know the truth. Come on. Oh, son of a bitch! Seriously, oh, shit. Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... Damn it! I Matt. think I just fucked it up. The relationship, no. I mean, it was fake, anyways. So who the hell cares? Okay. Offer cable car station. Um. Read book. Don't check your phone. Phone. Oh shit. <laughs> you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but the surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Um, uh, to have snowball. I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> oh, should have went there anyways. Okay. Oh. Boom. <laughs> hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chicken? <laughs> oh! Ah! Hey! <laughs> Come on. Oh hey, Mike. my goodness. Boom, okay. Now you got me. Okay. Destroyed. <laughs> Absolutely destroyed. You can't hide from me, Michael. I know. Sometimes doing nothing is the right thing to do. Okay. Yeah, don't hit the bird. That's true. Oh, and then what? Oh, oh. No more. Oh, oh yeah. Oh more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> uh, <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done city. 
So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Um... Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. the wall. Ah! Oh, ho, ho. Okay. Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. But you'll have to wait until later. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Damn. Let me check my status update. Wait. So, so. Oh, so this is the path I chose. Tech, basically. Okay. and symbols I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious most anxious um none but hmm I am not sure. I am so not sure right now. Mm. I don't know, I'll go with woman maybe. Okay, so crowds, planes. Hmm, this is a very tricky one. I would say maybe planes. Um, drowning. Snakes. He's just writing, he's chilling. Oh fuck, knives. Cockroaches. Snakes, cockroaches, snakes. Hmm. I mean, cockroaches is just a bug, so yeah, it's just a bug. He's chilling. Joker, clowns. To be honest, I feel none. I fear none. But maybe clowns are the closest. Mm. Oh, shit. 
Did that startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. This guy. He did it on purpose, Try man. To you. Speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Okay. Nope, I do not fear spiders. Keep going. Uh, still, gore. Uh, zombies? No, no, there's no chance. Wolves, probably wolves. Lightning, nope, wolves. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Snakes, clowns, and dogs. <laughs> the sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> Hell no. Uh, well, I'm afraid once again we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. Damn. Okay, that was interesting. Previously on Until Dawn. Damn. Oh, come on, she deserves it. Hannah! Did she What's going say on? she deserves it? It was just a Damn, prank, she said, bitch. No, shut she doesn't deserve she doesn't deserve this. Come on. First off, man. I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Dang. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? That feels the same to me. Josh, Hannah and Beth's brother. Thoughtful loving. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey guys, get up here okay? Yeah, well, more or less, but there's so Damn, he's you. disappointed. What's up with him? Oh, he's pissed. Okay guys, uh, I'm gonna end it here. If you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. And yeah, see you in part two. Goodbye.